Hi all. Uh, today we can have a discussion on this uh, non-fungible token uh, and metaverse. Actually, this uh, topic is uh, uh, very important now because the government of India uh, has implemented uh, taxation on digital asset. So when we uh, talk about digital asset, so these non-fungible tokens and metaverse is very important. So the major, uh, the digital asset, the government said about digital asset that uh, focused on this NFT. So the NFT market is very, uh, uh, the growth of NFT market is increasing actually. So that uh, the taxation, uh, the, the revenue derived from this NFT market is focused by the government. Now we can uh, look, uh, we can see the what is Metaverse. So the Facebook itself, uh, you know, changed their name to Meta. That means they are looking forward with this Metaverse. So the Metaverse refers to a 24 into 7 online world. Actually, this Metaverse, a lot of players are working in this Meta world and uh, there are not network of creators uh, and they are using this uh, kind of uh, decentralized uh, blockchain system uh, and uh, similar infrastructure. So the metaverse is a network of always on virtual environments in which many people can interact with one another. So there are a lot, lot of players in the market. They can buy and sell the digital asset. So digital asset uh, you know the, the market is working in 24 into 7 the market is sleepless so so that's a very interesting thing as compared to the other financial asset market so, you know stock market there is a fixed time uh, uh, so this market this NFT market like crypto market uh, has no specific time the market is open for 24 into 7 so that kind of uh, uh, market is more popular now so digital object while operating virtual representations or avatar of themselves there are digital we can uh, look all these detailed things in the coming part of the slide uh, so facebook is so marketing the concept of uh, metaverse that is renaming itself uh, meta to highlight its push to dominate the metaverse okay so the crypto market and NFT uh, NFT tokens, non-fungible tokens are part of the meta market. Metaverse, so every time you buy some Bitcoin, for example, that the transaction gets recorded to the Bitcoin blockchain, uh, which means the record is distributed to thousands of individual computers around the world. So nobody can hide it. It is open to public. Anybody can verify it. So that's a very interesting thing of uh, this metaverse. So the public blockchains like uh, Bitcoin and Ethereum are also transparent. All transactions are available for anyone on the internet in contrast to the traditional banking. So this, the, this is, uh, everyone can verify. This is uh, a pure uh, disclosed thing. So that kind of, uh, you know, this kind of uh, characteristics uh, lead for the metaverse uh, means the metaverse ecosystem is more popular. For example, uh, you could use a smart contract uh, on the blockchain to establish your ownership of a digital object. The digital object may be a piece of an art or a music uh, to which uh, no one else can claim the ownership uh, on the blockchain. So this is only one piece. It's a very unique. Nobody can duplicate. Nobody can uh, divide the digital asset so even if they save the copy of the computer okay so it's available in the, so everybody can uh, save and copy the same digital asset but they cannot own it only one person can own it that is a very uh, important significant characteristics of a digital asset so digital objects that can be owned like currencies a digital version of a currencies securities artwork uh, are treated as the crypto based digital assets so items like artwork and music on a blockchain are non-fungible tokens so 
uh, we will have a more explanation on the NFTs. Uh, so non-fungible means they are unique and it is not replaceable. This is only one piece and it cannot be uh, redesigned. It cannot divide. It cannot replace an animal because there is only one piece in the world. Okay. So the opposite of fungible items like currency. Any dollar is worth the same uh, as that can be swapped with the, any other dollar. So the fungibility means uh, replaceability. So the dollar, uh, the one dollar can be replaced with another one dollar. So it can be swapped with the other dollar. But the, this kind of digital asset, so the digital version or digital avatar of uh, the pictures, the design, the music, the ringtones, which cannot be replaced with only one piece in the world. If, if the particular piece is rare or scarce, somebody will buy it and they own it. Okay. Then the, the, the person who bought up digital asset may negotiate with others. Okay. So this, this is a scarce item. So that it's, you know, the, the concept of scarce. Whenever there is a scarcity, the demand will be increased. That's the very important principle followed by this digital asset. So why the metaverse matters? So the world is looking for the metaverse. Uh, if the metaverse does become a successor to the internet, so it's a revolution. Uh, who built it and how uh, is extremely important to the future of the economy. So the so there also some criticizers say that it's a very hyped thing. This NFT and metaverse system, it is hyped and there is no longer uh, be existing uh, because of some drawbacks. Okay, but still, uh, you know, uh, due to the technological revolution, this may be sustained sometimes. So the Facebook is aiming to play a leading role in shaping the metaverse. Uh, in part of uh, part by investing heavily in virtual reality so facebook itself uh, they changed the name as meta uh, to use this metaverse so now we can talk more about nft non fungible token these non fungible tokens are unique cryptographic assets digital assets that represent the ownership of a tangible or intangible asset and has some value on it so uh, I, I will speak about the value later. You see, it's like it's not a small value. It's maybe a big value because uh, these assets are very scarce. So the people are interested to own it. So uh, there are uh, bids submitted by the buyers. So based on this comparison of this value value of the bids and the, the topest bidder will get the order. Okay, so the, the uh, rarer uh, the asset, the DRR, the NFT. So if the asset is very rare, so the NFT will be costly. So NFT are blockchain based assets that can be, that can be also be traded just like other cryptocurrencies to make sizable gain. So it's, it's traded like cryptocurrencies because whenever there is a demand for cryptocurrency, uh, a particular cryptocurrency, its price will increase. Price will increase. Similarly, NFT. If the NFT is rare, so uh, NFT price will increase. So NFT is, uh, you know, as compared to cryptocurrency, there is a uh, when we talk about cryptocurrency, there is a major drawback is that, that there is no intrinsic value uh, of the cryptocurrency. There is no asset backing, etc. But this. NFT, you know, uh, they they tried to eliminate that comment because NFT, you know, they are focusing on a particular digital asset and based on the digital asset scarcity, the value is increasing. So there is an underlying asset that is a digital asset. Okay. Uh, then uh, we can uh, more than 10,000 NFT crypto pounds available in our different exchanges. So uh, it is purely based on the blockchain network so that the authenticity is uh, and uh, uh, authenticity is uh, good and you cannot change or hide it when 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 you honor of a digital asset everybody can verify you are an honor or not and the another important thing is it is not replaceable so one of the major nft selling happened you know Twitter CEO Jack Dorsey is selling an NFT of his first tweet. 
for 2.9 million dollars uh, so that was an amazing uh, sale uh, deal of nft which was happened recently and also uh, electronic musician grims also selling 6 million uh, dollars worth for her digital art so these two sellings are you know uh, created some kind of impression that anybody can uh, make or change their asset into an nft uh, and it it can be it can provide a better marketplace uh, for their digital asset so anything any design any uh, ringtone uh, which uh, which can be converted into a digital asset and uh, this NFT market provides uh, an opportunity for their uh, this kind of assets to an, a proper marketplace. Will NFT as become next gen investment avenue? That is an, another question. So the future will be of NFTs and cryptos, uh, crypto punks, NFT punks, etc. So NFT are tokens of things like art, collectibles, even real estate. So even uh, real estate can be also converted into an NFT. An artistic painting can be converted into NFT. A ringtone can be converted into NFT. So there are a lot of options uh, uh, provided by this particular technology. So we can convert the, our even a face, a face of a particular person can be converted into an NFT. So they can only have one official owner at a time. That is a very interesting feature. Only one official owner at a time, and they are the ownership is secured with blockchain, and it, anybody can verify. And, uh, no one can modify the record of ownership uh, or copy paste a new NFT into an existence. So it is, uh, it may be treated as a next gen finance investment. So in future uh, will be of NFTs because this the return, return provided by this finance and it's a market options provided by the this kind of uh, uh, technology is amazing. So the people uh, look NFT tokens as a next gen financial investment event. This slide shows uh, an example of uh, NFT that is uh, available in India, that is Amitabh NFT. So it's meticulously, uh, meticulously crafted and curated art versions of Amitabh Bachchan. So this NFT art has been exclusively hand written. Uh, hand drawn and uh, every big p punk collection is a collectible uh, collectible in its own right so various posters of amida bachan uh, has been converted into nfts and uh, it is available in the marketplace so various you know amida bachan has uh, pictureized uh, many uh, roles in different uh, movies who these avatars his uh, postures are uh, being transferred as uh, NFT and it is available in the market. And uh, I think uh, it, it has been uh, sell it off. Uh, uh, so uh, this is an example of uh, 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 NFT that is Amitabh NFT.